hello guys welcome to my channel the excellent hacker uh, today i'm going to show you how to use hascat to crack different kind of hashes so before getting into the tutorial please don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon okay so to demonstrate the use of hascat i will use this uh, crack the hacks crack the hash box from try hack me it contains multiple number of hashes which we need to crack so before getting into cracking hashes first step is you will need to identify what kind of hashes or what kind of hash it is so to do that just go in google and search hashcat hash examples and go to this site hashcat.net Okay, we can see in the side that it contain different um, hashes with uh, examples. And then there is a first column name hash mode. So we'll need this hash mode to feed in hashcat. So let's keep this uh, site in background. Okay, after that, let's see hashcat syntax. Uh, so what are hash flags? So let's access help menu. Let's type hashcat dash h hashcat dash h. So you can see here can then make information and some features, formats, attack modes, and types of hashes. You can see, uh, see here the hash mode and name also, but there are no any examples like in the uh, website so there are no examples and there are a couple of flags so the usage is like this hashcat options and hash file and then a word list so this is the syntax of how to use hashcat after that just i'm going to tell you about a couple of important flags that we will need so first one is dash m so it will feed what type of hash to hashcat uh, which will speed up the cracking process and after that so dash dash quiet uh, will not show any status and suppress the output after that dash dash force will suppress all the errors or warnings okay next one is and dash dash uh, restore it will restore the previous session these are the important flags that we will need i will not go into more deep on all uses of other flags now you know the hascat syntax so now let's um, start by cracking some hashes so we will start from this number one so let's copy it first and let's make a file name hash.txt and paste it here you can see that i created a hash.txt file So we can see here that I know it is MD5 hash, but um, to verify it, we can see here in this uh, examples the word count of this both hashes are same. So for basic hashes like MD5, or, uh, we don't need to actually specify the hash mode or hash type. So let's uh, crack this hash first. So to do that just type hashcat hashcat then give the hash you can also give the mode also dash m will give the mode and we know that hash mode for md5 is 0 from this table we can identify 
so you can feed dash m uh, zero also but for basic hashes you will not need to do that okay after you give the hash file then give the word list so i i would like to use this rocky.txt is located in user share word list rocky.txt then hit enter it is pretty simple to use hashcat so first one is hash.txt second flag is the word list okay then hit enter okay it will start cracking the hash okay the hash was cracked pretty fast we can see our hash name is md5 and status is cracked and the cracked file cracked output is easy so it's our first so first uh, hash is cracked okay now let's go to next hash the second one let's copy it let's paste that into hash.txt so okay we paste the hash into hash.txt you can see here yeah, uh, it is pretty it is a bit complex than md5 so we will need to identify which kind of hash it is so to do that just uh, let's check its length first so i'm going to use python to check its length so its length is 40 so let's check it with sha1 so okay, its length is also 40 so you can see here the match between this sha1 and the given hash so by practicing multiple times uh, you will automatically identify the hashes by just guessing also but for beginning you will not need to practice a bit okay let's crack the hash using hashcat so here i give a flag dash m this is hash type and 100 so 100 is hash id so we deducted it from here first column hash mode okay let's hit enter and crack the second hash also okay the hash card has cracked the second password also so our hash was correctly correct sha1 okay you can see uh, how many how much time it took to crack the hash okay let's copy this and check if it's correct or not okay let's um, go to next hash this third one let's copy it and paste it in our hash.txt file See, we can paste the hash in this hash.txt. So, so in this third example, I'm going to use hash id to identify the hash. Just give the command hash id, and okay, just give the command hash id, and then feed the hash. Okay, it found out that it is either this send through SSA256. So the common one is SSA two fifty six. So I think it is SSA two fifty six hash. So let's find the hash mode of SSA two fifty six. So you can see here the uh, 
hash mod of SSA256 is 1400. So let's again use hashcat to crack the hash. So mode is 1400. The rest of the text remains same. Okay, the hashcat cracked the next password also. It is let me in. So it cracked SHA2 256 also. Okay, let's go to next hash. Yeah, fourth. So it is a bit odd than the rest of the hash. First, let's paste it. Paste the hash. Okay, let's then identify the hash. So it is a bit unique. So we can use this find and feed chat with uh, dollar uh, numeric value y and dollar and another numeric value. So let's compare it in here. So I find I use find in this uh, Firefox to find for first character dollar. So we can see here that this is BC script is it matches the Python. So dollar to a dollar and O5. So its mode is 3200. Okay, let's crack this as also. Okay, just change the mode to 3200. Okay, dash dash force and dash o it will optimize optimize the cracking process press so capital o okay has cat uh, successfully cracked the uh, another has also but it took uh, some time yeah so the hash is blay b l e s i'm going to do this two hashes with uh, salt in it let's crack this one paste it in that our hash file okay let's we can see here that our hash starts from dollar sign six and again dollar. So let's check it in the examples. We can see here that this is the one that matches. It's SHA 512 and its hash mode is 1800. Okay, let's. Use them, change the mode to 1800. Rest of it same. Okay, we cracked another hash. So um, it took around 30 minutes to crack this hash. So it was a bit difficult. Uh, the cracked hash is Waka 99. Okay, now I'm going to do this final one. So the final hash is also salted. Let's copy the hash first. And let's paste it. So okay, the password the hash matches to this. 
H M A C S H A one with salt. So its has mode is one sixty. Okay, let's use. Let's just skip has mode one sixty. Okay, now it started cracking the hash. So at the end of the hash, you need to provide the salt also. It's uh, like this. So this not in this video. I'm not gonna do the rest. So just let it to, to crack the password. Okay, thanks for watching it. Please don't forget to subscribe the channel and if there are any queries, leave them in the comment section below.